in my view, uh, so deep neural networks are typically artificial neural network which are helping us in defining the relationship you know it's a different layers actually re defining relationship between input and output so what happens then you provide a lot of input then the ne neural network works and it defines actually relationship between the output and the input so especially uh, you know if you see take example of non-linear you know, relationship which is very very complex in time so when you provide a lot of data input data and you provide the output we are able to these networks are able to define non-linear relationship which is actually very important uh, further if you want to use this you know in production so very very important in in location what is happening you know uh, in computer vision especially you know what is happening that you know we use you know we extend this uh, in, uh, you know a neural network to a special temporal network so what happened we add dimension of location and you know time to this and then do uh, those special temporal you know uh, uh, analysis which helps actually you know uh, organizations to understand the relationship between a uh, time you know uh, you know time and other parameters so fourth dimension which is helping a lot for example so these uh, you know dnns right you know if you, if you call it when you established actually a uh, couple of you know models to solve particular problems so these you know helps us in creating those relationships and help you know next level it helps us in prediction so you can predict for example as i mentioned you can predict you know disease outbreak you can predict in fact in uh, you know, the supply and demand you know uh, aspects of it you can predict financial you know uh, aspects you can also predict in fact you know uh, various you know if you can't do in, in especially there is a very good example in location you know gis technology where you for example identify a particular type of feature you know and then you train the uh, model and if you run that model in entire you know country so in very short time you can identify those objects very quickly which helps actually a lot for more updates from CXO TV, please like and subscribe to our channel.